So I want to talk a little bit about the stripper gap uh, between the two stripper plates. And I've got a corn stalk um, in the row unit here so you can see, but normal settings, an inch and an eighth at the bottom, and then we want it a little bit uh, narrower at the, uh, or a little wider at the top so that the corn stalk can make its way out of the channel. So like an inch and three sixteenths um, at the top is, is great. But if they're hydraulically adjustable, the other thing we wanna do is make sure that when we set them, that we get at the center of the stripping tunnel directly above the center of the stock roll tunnel as well. But the other thing you can do that's the old fashioned method that I used as a kid is just simply grab the corn stalk out of a field, cut it off, bring it over here, and just make sure that the stripper gap is, is wider than the corn stalk. Uh, because the last thing we want to do is, if we've got a big girthy stalk, is for the stripper plate to hit it, and then it'll push the stalk forward and then once the stalk goes forward, it's just a chain of events and it's hard to get it to harvest. So anyway, make sure that the stripper gap is always wider than the corn stalk that you're harvesting.